In order to connect Outlook to Office 365, some situations require a manual configuration of the Outlook client. Normally, Auto Discover makes this a simple process, but we cannot always use that method. This is Ron Bratz from Liftoff, and in this video, I will demonstrate how to connect Office 365 to Outlook using a manual configuration. This is specifically for Office 365 based on the Exchange 2013 engine. The first thing we need to do is gather some information about this particular uh, user that we're going to configure. We need to go to test exchangeconnectivity.com. We're going to run an Office 365 test on Outlook, any, uh, Outlook Auto Discover. We need to fill in some information. There's one piece of information that we need to pull out of this report. If you scroll all the way to the bottom, there are a series of, of HTML tags. And what we're looking for is the host address information for this particular user. This is unique for each user in the system, so you need to repeat this for each one that you configure. Here on the screen next to this server tag, we'll highlight this entire section here, copy to the clipboard. Okay, next we're going to go to control panel on the machine where we're actually doing the configuration. We'll open up mail. We're going to create uh, show profiles and we're going to create a new profile. We're going to call this one Office 365. And then we're going to choose manual setup for the profile. Choose exchange server. paste in our server name there. For the username, we're going to use our full email address. Go to more settings. Under the security tab, we're going to uncheck the boxes. We're going to set network security to anonymous. Then we're going to go to connection, check the box, choose exchange proxy. In this field, we're going to use outlook.office 365.com check the box and in this field we need to put in msstd colon outlook.com check on fast networks check basic and that should do it apply these settings finish the wizard and the new profile should be ready to go through a manual configuration